Hello, welcome to SL Productions and the first part of the Top 50 Hootubers 2019. So yes, the Top 50 Hootubers is back. I put out a voting video about two months ago asking you to vote for your favourite Doctor Who YouTubers. I had a massive response. Over 750 people voted in this list, so it took a very long time to add up all the votes. And around 150 channels were nominated this year to appear in the top 50 YouTubers. So yes, I've counted them all up, I've put them in order, I've sent emails to a majority of the channels who have made it to the list, there's still a few more to go, and yes, in this part I will be counting down places 50 to 31. I haven't asked places 30 to 21 yet, I need to do that, that video will be out later next week probably in about two weeks time and then the final part will be out about a week after that so near christmas time so yes coming in at number 50 we do have dalim who reviews and here is a thank you video from dalim who reviews i was genuinely shocked when i got the message from samuel aka sl productions that i had made it onto this list i was not expecting it i am beyond excited and i just want to give a massive thank you to everybody who voted for me and my channel down reviews who onto this list it's absolutely amazing to be able to share this list with so many incredibly talented hootubers out there and also a massive thank you to everyone who voted i am sure that your favorite hootubers appreciate the love and support that you've shown them just as much as I appreciate the support that I've been shown. And biggest of all, just a massive, massive thank you to Samuel AKSL Productions for making such an incredible list yearly and making a true celebration of the Doctor Who YouTube community and just spreading so much love across just the whole platform. It's amazing. And also, uh, I feel privileged to be the first of many YouTubers that you're going to be seeing across this list. And I'm super excited to find some new channels and explore them. And I really hope that you do the same. I implore you to check out as many of these channels as you can. I certainly will be. And that's basically all I have to say. Thank you once again to everybody who has voted. Congratulations to everyone else that made it on this list. And if you didn't make it on, then maybe you will next year. Um, with that said, I hope you enjoy the rest of the list. So yes, that was Dalim Who Reviews. Please go and check out Dalim Who Reviews as well as all the different channels on this list. So yes, moving on at number 49, we do have Friends of the Ood Kind, a great Doctor Who YouTuber, relatively small, but please go over to Friends of the Ood Kind Productions and help them out. They need more views and need more subscribers as they make good quality content, which I highly recommend. Coming in at number 48, we do have All Things Doctor Who, a collaboration of several different Doctor Who fans, a really great channel. Channel. There's loads of things on there. There's Doctor Who reviews, Doctor Who DVD videos, Doctor Who location videos, Doctor Who discussion videos, basically all things Doctor Who. So if you want all things Doctor Who, go to all things Doctor Who. Now coming at number 47, we do have TARDISNet, another channel which I hadn't heard of before the top 50 YouTubers. But yes, thank you for bringing TARDISNet to my attention and I hope by doing this video I will bring TARDISNet and other channels who are underrated to other people's attention as well. So yeah, TARDISNet, great Doctor Who YouTuber, I highly recommend you go and check them out. Now coming out at number 46, we do have Overturn Audios, a Doctor Who YouTuber who makes fan Big Finish audio kind of videos. So yes, if you like Big Finish, I highly recommend going to check out Overton Audios, a great channel, please go and check them out. Coming at number 45, we do have a Doctor Who fan film channel, and this is Doctor Who Velocity. If you're missing Doctor Who, go over to Doctor Who Velocity, there's some great Doctor Who fan films on there, and I highly recommend going over to Doctor Who Velocity if you like Doctor Who fan films and miss Doctor Who while it's not on TV. And coming in at number 44, we do have Ewan Hoyle NZ, and here is a thank you video from Ewan. So yes, please go and check out Ewan's channel, a great channel, I highly recommend, there's a few Doctor Who fan films on there as well. So yes, coming in at number 43, we do have Doctor Freedom. Now Doctor Freedom came 50th in last year's list, so yes, he's worked his way up to number 43. You know, in about 5 years time, he could be at number 1. If you come low on the list, it's great, it's a massive achievement to come even low on the list at number 50 because over 150 channels were nominated this year so it is an achievement to get on the list so yes feel proud of yourself for making it to the list 
there were loads of channels this year who unfortunately didn't make it. So yes, go and check out Dr. Freedom as well as all the other channels on this list as they deserve to be in the top 50 YouTubers. And even if you didn't make it to the top 50 YouTubers and got votes, that's still an achievement because who knows, next year, which I haven't confirmed yet, so it might not happen, and the years after, you might make it to the list. Now coming at number 42 we do have Pertwee Smith 11, a great Doctor Who YouTuber, does a lot of Doctor Who DVD reviews and collections, a lot of Doctor Who discussion videos. Pertwee Smith 11 is a great channel, some high quality content on there. So yes, go and check out Pertwee Smith 11, it's not John Pertwee by the way. So coming at number 41 we do have Phoenix Smith and here is a thank you video from Phoenix. Hello, so uh, apparently I've come in 41st. In the top 50 YouTubers. Wow, I'm honestly amazed to be on the list and very, very jazzed. Um, I make videos because I want to share a, a love and laughter towards Doctor Who and, and filmmaking. Um, so it really means a lot that that's working, you know, so people are connecting with it and uh, enjoy what I'm putting out there enough to th uh, throw some votes in here, which I really wasn't expecting. Um, so, you know, thank you really to everyone who did that. Uh, it means a lot to me to know that you exist and you're out there and you like what I'm doing uh, and will continue to do, hopefully. Um, also, thank you for this to this uh, institution the top 50 YouTubers is a concept it sounds like it takes a lot of work to run but I know I've appreciated knowing that you know people are out there and like my stuff so I'd imagine everyone is as appreciative of get you know having this forum to get that feedback and also having this forum to share other YouTubers that you might not have heard of and you know throw some spotlight on people um, so I think that's really cool. So thank you for running this and thank you to everyone who voted uh, for me. And I hope you will uh, stick with my videos and continue to enjoy as we laugh and love Doctor Who. Laugh at and love Doctor Who together. Um, I don't know how to end this. Um, thank you and enjoy the rest of the the list uh, is going to cut out really awkwardly. <laughs> I'm really selling myself for anyone who doesn't know what my videos are. Please watch my video. So yes, please go and check out Phoenix Smith if you already haven't. A great Doctor YouTuber. Previously, he was part of Five Who Fans, which unfortunately shut down earlier this year. But Phoenix still makes videos, so please go and check out Phoenix Smith. Now coming at number 40, we do have Babel Colour. Now Babel Colour, I've not actually seen in person before. I don't know who Babel Colour is, but they do make great Doctor Who edit videos of classic Doctor Who episodes. They sometimes colourise them, they sometimes colourise the title sequence, they make little animations, and they do Doctor Who edits. A really good channel. I think Babel Colour is linked to John Smith, who made Who Lock back in 2013. I might be wrong on that factor, but yes, a great channel, Babel Colour. So yes, please go and check out Babel Colour if you already haven't. Now coming at number 39, we do have Doctor Disco. Now Doctor Who Disco is a great channel. They do a lot of Doctor Who Big Finish videos, a lot of Doctor Who Book videos. So yes, please go and check out Doctor Disco if you already haven't. A great Doctor Who YouTuber. It's not Peter Capaldi, as he used to call himself. I'm Doctor Disco. Now coming at number 38, we do have Doctor Who. Not Doctor Who, Doctor Whom. And yeah, Doctor Whom, a great channel. I really like their videos, a great channel. They've got a lot of Doctor Who figure videos on there. So yes, I would recommend going checking out Doctor Whom if you already haven't. I'm saying the same thing with pretty much every YouTuber. Now coming at number 37, we do have Mr. Tardis Reviews. Now Mr. Tardis Reviews has over 10,000 subscribers, a very 
formal channel who does some great Doctor Who videos of a very high quality, a really good filmmaker. So yes, I'd recommend going and checking out Mr. Tardis Reviews. There's some really good informative videos on there. Now coming at number 36, we do have another Doctor Who figure channel, and this is Vote Saxon 07. They do Doctor Who figure videos, they do Doctor Who reviews sometimes. They do a lot of Doctor Who videos of a high quality, normally regarding Doctor Who merchandise and figures. So if you're into that, go and check out Vote Saxon 07. Vote Saxon 07. Yeah, unfortunately, Saxon isn't standing this time. So yes, coming out at number 35, we do have The Good Dialect. Now, The Good Dialect is a great channel, really like their videos. They do a lot of Doctor Who book videos and a lot of Doctor Who collection videos. So if you're into Doctor Who collection videos and Doctor Who book channels, I would go and check out The Good Dialect. So yes, moving on to number 34. So coming out at number 34, we do have Fractured Timeline. Now Fractured Timeline, a great channel, do Doctor Who fan films, really good high quality fan films. I would highly recommend, if you like Doctor Who fan films, to go and check out Fractured Timeline. A really good acting in the videos, some good visual effects for a low budget films. So yes, I would go and check out Fractured Timeline if you like Doctor Who films and Doctor Who fan films, and if you miss Doctor Who, go and check out Fractured Timeline. And coming in at number 33, do, we do have Favis. Now Favis, great channel, and here is a thank you video from no, none other than Favis. Enjoy. Hey everyone, this is Starius. Ooh, that's weird. Addressing you directly. Anyways, I'd just like to say thank you for choosing me in the top 50 YouTuber list. I am absolutely honoured to be on the list. You know, whatever place it is, obviously, I came 33rd, which is which is massive. Obviously, I'm just so grateful for the support that I've received from the community and all of you subscribing, so thanks so much. Um, and I hope that you enjoy what I have to come in the future. Okay, bye. So yes, that was the thank you video from Faris. Please go and check out Faris as well as all the other channels on this list. Now coming out at number 32, we do have Captain Jimmy Pie. Now Captain Jimmy Pie, a great channel. They're up from their position last year. So yes, congratulations to Captain Jimmy Pie. Captain Jimmy Pie does a lot of Doctor Who themed videos around Doctor Who figures, does a lot of custom made Doctor Who figure videos. He does a lot of Doctor Who fact file videos and Doctor Who theory videos. So if you're into Doctor Who theories and the deeper mythology of Doctor Who, I would recommend going to check out Captain Jimmy Pie. Now finally, at number 31, we do have Transcendental Productions. Now Transcendental Productions is a great channel again, does Doctor Who fan films, does Doctor Who reviews. I'd highly recommend going and checking out Transcendental Productions, no, Transcendental Productions. I think I've read it wrong, but yes. Please go and check out that channel, as well as all the other channels on this list. Once again, I'm sorry for the delay, but come on, what isn't delayed these days? So yes, until the second part, goodbye.